Hey, good morning, Anu. The Detroit Fire Department, they've actually scheduled two extra companies today. They are on staff, on standby, just waiting for those extra calls to come in. There's other staff members for the Detroit Fire Department that know they are on call. They could be called in in addition to those two extra companies if these winds get bad and those power lines begin to fall. Now, the Michigan State Police, they've got a lot of really great tips because once the power goes out, you know, no matter how fast ETE is working, you could be without it for a couple of hours. So tip number one, get one of these bad boys, a little battery backup for your cell phone. Make sure you got it fully charged right now because once it runs out of juice, you may have a harder time recharging it without it. Also, and I love this tip, get jugs of water like this. You can just fill them up from your tap if you want. Put it in your refrigerator because if the power goes out, these jugs of water, they'll actually help keep your refrigerator colder for longer. So that's really handy. And of course, if the power goes out, you could run out of light. So you want to make sure you have a good flashlight. There we go. That one works. I won't shut it directly at you. And you need to have plenty of extra battery backup. If you've got any of family members, friends, neighbors who rely on something that plugs into the wall for a medical need, go check on them. Make sure they have a backup generator or any of the batteries that they need to get through the day. One more really fantastic tip that I almost forgot about and I bet you might as well. If you use a garage door opener to get into your house, make sure today before you head out the door, you take an actual key because if the power goes out, you might not be able to get in that garage door. You'll need a key to either unlock your garage or unlock the house. That just will help you out, make things go a little more smoothly just in case these high winds do knock some of those lines down. Reporting live in Detroit, I'm Jennifer Ann Wilson. Back to you. Yeah, great information and tips there. Thank you, Jennifer Ann.